right guys so here we go again today we're going to be working on jumping spider enclosures homemade and springtime's coming jumping spiders are about to be coming out and it's just jumping spiders are neat guys i mean they are just the coolest things ever had one called noodles for a long time and she had a bunch of babies because i ended up putting a mail in there with her and then yeah she ate the mail so jumping spiders are really good by themselves but anyways yeah we're gonna work on some jumping spider enclosures and get ready for uh, springtime all right this is what we're gonna be making the jumping spider enclosures out of these are their old pub mix that you can get at the sam's club a little snack mix and the ones you get at walmart but got a bunch of water spots in them right now because i washed them so we're gonna do our good old-fashioned distilled vinegar and water solution and clean them up real good and then we're gonna get our drill bits and drill and make the little tiny holes all over the place and get them ready to get decorated and substrate and all that good stuff and jumping spiders do like to make their nest on top so it's you know, gonna be kind of hard getting this on and off but I've learned if you put enough uh, like flowers and plants and all that good stuff, they will actually make their nest in there, which I'll show you my other spider enclosure inside. This is Noodle's old enclosure, which I've showed y'all before because I was thinking about putting a, a pink toe tarantula in here, but she actually made her nest in these flowers and her web nest or whatever. It was really cool. I mean, she would, you know go to the top every once in a while and i spray it down and get a drink but she always made hers in these flowers but yeah that's going to be probably a jumping spider enclosure too i don't know wife's kind of freaking out about me getting a tarantula so we'll see what happens all right guys y'all can see the difference now see got it all cleaned up with the vinegar water solution versus that one so Tiny man's good stuff. Yeah, sorry for the beer boxes in the background. I saved those for my buddy's mom. She's doing a wall and beer boxes, so I'm gonna cut them up for her and get them ready. But yeah, there's one. All right, both of them all cleaned up, ready to drill some holes. All right, we got our drill bit ready to go. Not too big, not too small. It could work out just fine. All right, here we go. We got air holes drilled everywhere on top this one came out a little bit better I thought because it's bigger but yeah I got all the air holes drilled in there drilled some on top so there's ample airflow but yeah you now have jumping spider I guess we call them terrariums made out of uh, pub mix containers from Sam's Club and Walmart. All right, now it's time to get all the goodies out and see what we can make this look like. All right, everybody. I just wanted to take a break to show you all what's going on here because it is a process building these things, but it's so much fun. And that's what I wanted to stop and say real quick. I'm sitting here. I don't know if you can see, but I got my headphones on. I am watching Doctor Sleep and I am creating tanks for jumping spiders. And it's so much fun. So, I'm making this one for my buddy, which is actually the daughter's boyfriend. And I'm making this one for myself. Yes, I'm taking the bigger one. But, anyways, yeah, it's a process, but it is so much fun. All right, so here's my buddies. His is gonna be nice and simple. But look at all that room the spider has to crawl around and make its decision where it wants to do. Got the stick right there. I'll curl up the stick, do its thing there. And you know, spiders crawl on the side. But yeah, I thought that came out pretty good. Nice and simple. But quite nice 
I mean, I'm still working on this one. I just can't decide what I want to do. Someone came and joined us. Shiloh was wanting some attention. So she came out here to hang out. Still got the headphones on. Sorry for the sunlight. Still watching Dr. Sleep. Oh, the belly. Hold on. Get it out of there. But yeah. Shiloh wanted some attention, so we're going to take a break. Love on Shiloh for a little bit. Hmm. Ain't nothing wrong with that at all. It's a good break. But yeah, still a mess out here. Still working on everything. But I done kicked out the hot glue gun. I, I, we're, we're playing dangerous now. I've just got so many ideas to do out here and things are starting to come together. I don't know. I'm having fun. All right, I don't care who you are. I ain't never seen jumping spiders and closures like this. That's freaking amazing what you can do with hot glue. Guys, hot glue is not going to hurt any of your critters. But yeah, I've got like these sticks have been cutting out. just for different spiders crawl on everything you look at mine i mean we've got one sticking out here on the side we've got one sticking on the side i did some chopsticks there that was my buddy's idea that was pretty cool that was for the tree frog's tank but guys this is absolutely amazing and i'm having so much fun doing it i know i said it before but wow hello Guys, this is fun. Cannot wait to get some jumping spiders to put in here. And I can't wait for my buddy Jesse, which I call Jesse Bear, because it's Blazely's boyfriend, and I call him, uh, or I call her, my bad, Bear. So, AKA, he's Jesse Bear. But yeah, oh my God, it's so cool. Look at all that room to crawl around and make webs and do whatever they want to. That is freaking amazing. And then mine I'm still working on, but mm, yeah, that's awesome. Everybody. The hot glue came in handy. Put a couple plugs up there. He's got his greenery, a little bitty rock. The jumping spider has plenty of places to crawl around and make itself a nest or whatever he or she wants to. The front view looks very nice. Mine is done. Little mushroom, wood, flowers. Also hot glued some wood on top. But yeah, I think they came out pretty nice. So, I hope you all enjoyed. These are jumping spider enclosures made from PubMix containers. One from Walmart, one from Sam's Club. You know everything's bigger from Sam's Club. All right. Appreciate everybody watching. Thank you.